Welcome to day 18. The reading is Luke chapter 2, verses 8 to 12. The appearance. Night time has fallen across Bethlehem. Though Caesar Augustus's census has rendered the town a little busier than normal, everything else about its existence appears as ordinary as ever. In Bethlehem's surrounding hills, the shepherds are working the dreaded night shift. However many they have completed throughout their careers, their task is simply always the same. Keep awake, keep alert, and above all, keep the sheep safe. After all, the sheep were needed for use in the temple sacrifices six miles to the north in Jerusalem. It's easy to picture them gathered on that hillside, huddled perhaps around a burning fire, telling stories and sharing the frustrations of their work. Occasionally one looks up, glancing toward the sheep to ensure everything is intact. On and on this situation repeats itself until a moment so unexpected and stunning sets the whole hillside ablaze in glorious bright light. An angel of the Lord appears and God's glory shines around those shepherds. Naturally they are terrified yet as they weigh up whether to run, hide or sacrifice the sheep in favour of themselves the angel speaks the same message given to Zechariah and Mary. Do not be afraid. There is nothing to be fearful of. In fact, there is only hope, awe and wonder as they become the first to hear the good news of the most glorious revelation ever proclaimed to humanity. Today, in the town of David, a Saviour has been born. He is the Messiah, the Lord. Jesus has come, the wonderful Counselor, mighty God, everlasting Father, Prince of Peace, has made his home. And he invites us, like those first shepherds, to seek and find him, that he might save and transform us. Let's pray. Father, I thank you for your good news of great joy. Help me to grasp more fully the wonder of your coming and what that means. Amen. And our challenge for today is to find a map and pray for God's good news to be made known amongst all nations.